Welcome to Dad's Coin Video. Alright, welcome to another bag hunt. This is the second to last bag hunt from my three pound bag that I started with. We've almost gone through over 350 coins, so let's get 15 more out. The last bag hunt will have 16 in it, and we're going to have a giveaway associated with it. So I hope you've been paying attention during all these hunts um, because we are going to give some coins away from the hunt. I'll explain in another video. So in the meantime, let's get our 15 coins. There's 12, 13, 14, 15. Alright, so we'll start off with Haiti, 1953, five cent times, there we go, like the cannons on there, <laughs> definitely looking kind of pirate-esque there with the sails, the cannons, the palm tree. Don't mess with us. Belgium, 1904. Nice. With a hole in it. Ten centimes. Very cool. 1946. I think this is one centavo from Cuba. Yep. It's a nice coat of arms there. Argentina. Ooh. Is this 12 sided? Yeah, 12 sided coin. Nice. 1963, 10 pesos. There's got to be some sort of steel. It's way too shiny. Probably stainless steel. Still has retained tons of detail. Very nice coin. I've never seen this one before. That's cool. Let's see. Krolesu Polski? Fenegal, 1918. Is this Polski supposed to be Poland? Might be Poland. Looks like it's got iron in it. You see the rust coming through. This might be one of those uh, steel-plated iron or nickel-plated iron. Got some stars next to the date. That's cool. I'm going to go with Poland on this. Five Finnegau. That sounds about right. Ooh, going to the Middle East. Hmm. I feel like we've seen this one before. Well, I'm gonna have to let you know later. My best guess. Oh. Let's say Pakistan. No, not Pakistan. Pakistan has a star in the moon. So let's go with Saudi Arabia. We'll try that one out. All right, 1982, 20 centimes from France. It's a newer one, comparatively. <laughs> 
Oh, we've seen a million of these. Swiss 1952. One wrapping. I just had a bunch of them from that same year in this bag. Speaking of which, <laughs> there's another one. Same exact coin. All right, I think that's Denmark. Ooh, that's a beauty of a crown. Still got lots of details in it. 1954. Ten, mar ten ore from Denmark. I just think it's cool that uh, they're mint marked down here. You get a heart. <laughs> and heart S. I wonder if it's kind of like those lovers that carve their initials with a heart into a tree. And whoever designed this is just uh, showing their love towards whoever in a public way, but anonymously. <laughs> All right. Bohemia and Moravia. Or Moravia. Yeah, 1942. Is that the aqueduct? All right, well, that's definitely out of zinc. But cool. Really nice details still on that lion. So it hasn't been worn too much, even though it's got its colored and a little bit oxi oxidization. Right. Iceland, 5RR. 1946. I'm loving that we've been getting some old Icelandic coins. Old-ish, I should say. I mean, they're 80 years old or so from this bag. Oh, 1948, one farthing from the UK. We've had plenty of those in this bag as well. Nineteen seventy-nine Guatemalan ten centavos. We've had a lot of these in the bag too. And Bolivia. We've had a few of these. Got the llama. <laughs> I did a spotlight video on Bolivia if you want to go check it out. And I'll stick the card up there. It was a lot of fun to make it. 1951. One Boliviano. All right. Well, that's it for this bag. Oh, whoops. Almost knocked over the camera. Um, thanks for joining me, and I'm going to post another video with the rules on the giveaway and how you can win some of these coins. Thanks for always watching, and we'll see you later. This has been Brad and his world coins.